Hey, howdy folks, welcome back to the Red Dead Redemption 2 series episode, maybe 47, 48? Not sure, we've got some quests to do, we just kicked freaking Air Strauss out of the freaking village. We're heading over here to Hamish Sinclair, we're gonna fish with him. Been doing a lot of side quests lately. Um. Alright, well, here we go. A lot to do today. A lot to still do in the series. Trying to get a lot of stuff done here. Before everything ends. When I do another main quest. Before I get John out. That was a moose. Freaking wolves, bro. Oh, he ain't got nothing for me. He just want me to... He's just asking for help. That's fair. That shotgun's shot sound is so loud. It's awesome. There's this old horse. Well, this fish, man. Hamish! Arthur! Well, come in. You said we might go out fishing. Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go with my boat. Good. Here she is. You mind rowing? Sure. What are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Oh. <laughs> mean as hell, Northern Pike. Uh. Eats everything else that spawns around here, its own kind included. Well, is that our bait then? A jack or something? Hell no. He's a clever old bastard. <laughs> I made these. This one's mine. You're gonna have to spare. They are pretty. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> Come on, let's push off. I'll show you where we're rowing to. <sighs> Take us over there to the right. We'll set up ten yards or so offshore. He don't keep far away from me, the tyrant. Wants me to know whose lake it is. We'll show him who's boss. <laughs> the optimism of youth. You got that lore I gave you? Get her out. Right here. We'll cast off the <laughs> island. Okay. I spent years working on that. Finding the right combination of feathers, twine, and glimmer. Making them, losing them, getting them right. I tried coins, shell cases, even a medal. Finally found something he seems to like. A 
And now I hear you can buy him in a shop. Well, it wouldn't be quite so satisfying. Getting him with something shop bought. Easy for you to say. <laughs> but maybe I'm inclined to agree. Come on. Bite. Got something? Ah, I got something, all right. <laughs> uh, hey, him. Hey, you need Come on now, Tyrant. I got you. I got you. Come on. Ah, <laughs> ah went all slack. Went all slack. Come back. No, oh, it's a drop back. Uh, oh. <laughs> hey, come on up here. You lost anything? It's <laughs> just my rod. <clears throat> We've got my toes too. They weren't wooden. <sighs> you want another go at them? I still got my lure. Nah. He's your fish now. Cast away. We'll come at him from the other way. Row over there. When he bumped me, I had to check twice. Thought I'd find a chunk of me missing. Man eating pike? That would be a first. I'm not so sure. We won't catch him from here, believe me. Huh, big old pipe. Okay, right here. Our hopes of catching this bastard lie with you. Cast back to where we were, and make sure to use that lure I gave you. You can speed that up a little. Them. Real. Let's land the bastard. Reel it in. Don't let him pull you. Come on, come on, come on. He's a tough one. Start reeling. I mean, this keeps coming. He's just slow. Stand steady. This feels like it's not even coming in. You 
doing good. Maybe it's, that's just how the legendary fish work. He's tiring, all right. It's not even coming in at all, man. This is so stupid. Like, go faster, Arthur! He's coming up. He's right back to where we were. There's the yank. Come on. Got him. Gracious. Goodness gracious, man, that was wild. Here, here. Oh. Uh, hold her. <sighs> Pass me the tyrant. That is if you're sure you don't want him. Oh, I ain't gonna poach from your pond. <sighs> well, I'll give him his honors then. He sure was something, huh? <sighs> he was. <clears throat> Thanks for taking me out. I appreciate the company. That's one hell of a fish. Ain't he something? <laughs> so long. Hey, you ever want to go out hunting? You stop by again. I'm ah. 
Legendary Hunter. Alright, we'll have to come back for that. Well, here we go. Where are we going? Um, we're on up here at the Oak Craze, whatever. Um, I think the right idea would be go ahead and doing this. Then we'll hit Sadie Adler. Hey, boy. But we are a good long ways away, so. Alright. Well, we just get to ride a long way down to the bottom of the map. We are at nearly the top. But it's okay. We're having fun. That was fun, kind of. It just took too long to row them in. <laughs> took ages. I wish I had not Ga not Josie. I wish I had Gary. some of our horse stimulants. Hello. I don't have a horse survivor, so if Josie dies, we are screwed. Let's just not let Josie die. Alright, this is a stagecoach hit. This is what this is. We're not talking to the professor yet. intrusive ain't wise what I don't know what's going on there but it didn't even give us an option to be like Did you kill this woman so I bet he didn't do it okay Come on, wagon. Who we got here? You 
stop that wagon. What is it? A uh, word of warning. I seen a big old gator just sitting in the road up ahead. I think we'll take our chances. Step down from there and drop your weapons. I'm taking this ship. Oh, no, you ain't. You ain't getting nothing. I can't believe I'm killing for this guy's stuff. Well, <laughs> murdered for that. Goodness, man. <laughs> Will you move? All right, we should be close on this, dude. what in the world he's making. man wonderful <laughs> you got my money <laughs> it's it's for a very good cause uh, my name is professor andrew bell the third perhaps you've heard of me <laughs> can't say that i have oh i'm an inventor uh, maybe you've read about me <laughs> uh i don't read much oh oh well that's too bad oh yes <laughs> you got my money <clears throat> oh, well, it, it is the most wonderful invention, friend. Oh, you, sir, have done a great All deed. All I've done is get some creep a lot of drink. <laughs> creep is excellent. No, nonsense. Now, you've helped me develop the most humane machine imaginable. A way to induce calmness to our most troubled souls. A way to end the barbarity of a public hanging. Oh, so, so humane. Oh, he's, about. he's not gonna... The electric chair. What? Gotcha. It's a chair full of electricity. Quite fascinating. It calmly and peacefully dispatches the sinners uh, to face judgment. Yes, judgment. Yeah. Where mm. is it? Well, uh, it's in my laboratory. The next thing I need is a, a demonstration, a public one. Huh. Uh, do you know the police chief? Hmm? As well as anyone. Oh, wonderful. Perhaps you can encourage him to let me demonstrate the chair. It will help bring this town into the next century. Yes, could you do that? Hmm? Goodness. And where is that? Again, bro? Not again. We can game stamina if we just run. All right. Welcome back to San Denis. Do you want to be happy, sir? Then you need to be rich. And the only way, the easiest way, the best way to get rich is to read about it in my book. This is the 
It feels like some of these fools want us to get caught. Hello? How do they how do they go in here and they don't know? Chief, I'm representing the inventor of a humane execution machine. An electric chair. And he uh he wants to demonstrate his invention here. Ah, I'm familiar with the man and his work. Tell you what, I'll give you a permit. But it's gonna cost you a hundred dollars in fees. Hey, look, this will save you money in the long run. And uh it'll save the condemned a whole lot of pain. That remains to be seen. But I'll give you a permit for fifty. Fine. Why do I have to pay it? Okay. Well, the price is fair. Here you go. And here, sir, is your permit. A pen and unusual formalities, of course, such as uh, finding a suitable candidate for humane dispatchment. I'll tell that to the professor. Good luck. I guess we're running back. Da 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 da. Give me more XP. Come on. Listen, listen to me, friends. This book is precious gold. Ooh, we can take on another quest over there, but I'm just gonna give this to the professor. What you want? Brandy. Two brandies, bud. Hello. It's two dollars a glass. Oh, better be good then. Mm. It's the best. Thank you. Santé. Mm. Ah, it's quite a country you're building here, eh? Well, me personally? Mm. I don't know. What do you do? Mostly, I just shoot people. Mm. How very American of you. I love it. What do you do? Oh, mostly I, I pose, I show off, I complain. Oh, how very French. I know. <laughs> I am ridiculous. <laughs> I have been all over the world. I have seen the sights, and I have discovered the one eternal truth that I am a pies, um, how do you say, all ass. Mm? Asshole? Mm. That too. That too. <laughs> mm. Well, at least you have some self-knowledge. <laughs> Where were you on your journey? Mm. All the civilized world. Painting my little pictures, meeting the locals, you know. You a painter? No, I'm a whole ass. I thought we had covered this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, mm. but you paint. Not according to salons at Paris, no. According to them, I cannot draw, I cannot paint, and I should go away. And so I went away. You miss Paris? Mmm, that smelly, filthy place with old buildings and ghosts and shit and French people. I have that right here. Mm. I guess so. Mm. You know, uh... Arthur. Charles, you know, Arthur, don't believe in art. Mm. It's lies. Believe in women. They're the truth. Art is lies, but the vagina, that is truth. Breasts is truth. Art. For it is. If you say so. Oh, trust me, I've tried both. One is better, much better. <sighs> so, I uh, must be boring you. Uh, but, here. What is it? Uh, it's just a little doodle. 
Eh? You know, entirely worthless, unless you want to wipe your bottom with it. But I wanted to say thank you for the drinks. Well, that's very kind, Charles. Mm, no matter. Good meeting you. Mm. At least not much with him. They didn't even assign us anything. What in the world? Well, let's talk to the professor real quick. Well, actually, the episode's over, but we can get close to the professor and we'll start in a sec. Sorry, in the next one. Alright. Stop right here. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That's it for me. I'm out.